Hey, sweet pea. Oui? Why the train? You always pick the train. I'm not sure. Maybe because this is where it all started. Where you taught me to shoot and to cut my hair. To be ready for what was coming. Uh, you were a quick stunny. You're mine this time. I'm worried, Lee. I've got a lot of people depending on me. And I don't know if what I'm doing is right. Oh, I know that feeling. You know, I was uh, making it all up as I went along, right? <sighs> Couldn't let on, of course. With you being so little. You kinda had to think on your feet. Monsters took over the world. And you got stuck taking care of an eight-year-old girl. You were a handful, but I didn't get stuck with anything. You kept me going. You want to tell me about what you're up against? I'm with a new group now, and I've been in so many. And they always fall apart. But I really like this one. It's different. It almost feels like home. That's a good thing. It's hard being alone out there. But we're in trouble. Some bad people captured my friends, and getting them back might get the rest of us killed. I'm not worried. What? Whatever trouble you're in, you get out of it. You get your friends out of it. You don't know that. I know you're a survivor. The Clementine I know is gonna fix it. I really believe that. You're right. I just needed to hear you say it. I'm going to get my friends out of this. Every one of them. Alive. That's right. Imagine what Lewis is gonna say when he sees your face. Those boys are gonna have hope again knowing that you came to rescue them. <sighs> oh, Sweet Pea, you know you always get like this before something big. Remember how scared you were before you charged into that mess at McCarroll Ranch? You survived that, didn't you? That was different. I was alone. I know. It's harder when you have something to lose. But having people you care about, that's a good thing. Friends. A girl who loves you. They're fighting beside you. Because of you. Come see me again. When you've gotten them out, okay? Out. And safe. Sound good? And hopefully we can talk about happier things. Lee? I miss you so much. I wish you were really here. <sighs> I miss you too, Clementine. But we'll have to make do with pretending. Thank you, Lee. Talking to you always makes me feel a little bit better. I meant to ask. How's the boy? He's good, Lee. You'd like him. I bet. You teach him to shoot yet? <laughs> you have no idea. I guess the world got pretty hard since I left it. A kid growing up in it, he'd be hard too. You're in my shoes now, raising a kid. Think you got a handle on it? Uh, it can't be easy. Wanting to give him a childhood, but knowing what it takes to survive now. EJ's amazingly. I've taught him to be strong and brave and capable. He'd be so proud. You mean more than I already am? Just 
Look at you. <laughs> Thought I told you to keep this short. Um, you don't know how hard it is to find scissors these days. <laughs> Goodbye, Lee.